Dot e. The students of grade 5 and 6 representing the English club are here to enact a story on friendship and unconditional love towards our parents and our nation. From far away places to sit in his birds would come from far away places to sit on his branches and chip their songs. It was a beautiful and a happy cheek. There was a boy from a nearby town who spent time with the chi after his school. He shared everything with the chi, his ideas, plans for future, his thoughts and everyday happenings at school. And even he made the tree to Narayas why it was so beautiful and happy. One day, boy said to the tree, Tree, you are very lucky and happy because you watch the best view of this earth. The sparkling water, the setting sun, the breeze, no wonder you are the happiest one. Yes, of course, I agree. I'm happy for whatever I have in my life, but I would be more happy when I share it with you. Thus, the tree shared a very special bond with the small boy who never wished to miss his company. As days passed by, the boy grew up and, and the tree was mostly alone waiting to see the boy. Then one day the boy came to visit the tree and the tree was very happy and he called out to the boy. Come boy, come and light the fire trunk and spend your time joyfully. No my friend, I am too busy now. I want to buy the things. I want to see the world. So he said to the boy, I don't have money to give you, but I only have leaves and apples. You can take it. The boy was happy to listen to the kind words of the tree. So he climbed up its trunk and gathered all the apples from the tree and carried them away to sell them in the market by expressing his gratitude. Year passed. After a long time, the boy visited the tree. And it was very happy and said, Come boy, come. Let us stay together. No, my friend. Face running behind happiness. Sometimes you have to face the difficulties. If not, do one thing as you wish. Build a boat by the tip of my truck and stay far away. And far away you put. Will you be happy then? The boy cut off its The city was not the same anymore. As before, the tree was very happy to see him and said, Ha, you came. It is so nice to see you. Where were you? Even I missed you. I said to another city, I lived there for a few years. You are breathing heavily. Yes, the pollution of the city is making it difficult to breathe. Yes, I agree. The city has changed a lot. I don't need anything to do. Yes, you are right. The forest is disappearing. The mountain cannot be clean. The board and the tree spend their time happily together as good friends forever.